We'll guide you through how to use a USB on your iPhone. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, we need to go and connect it to our iPhone. Now, depending on what type of USB you have, it will vary a little bit. Most people probably have the traditional USB-A plug like this, but you may have a USB-C or even a lightning USB because some USBs can plug straight into the iPhone. So if they can, plug it straight in, but some won't. And so therefore you'll need to get an adapter. To get an adapter, you'll need to know what port your iPhone has to get the right one. So iPhone 15s and newer have the have USB-C ports while iPhone 14s and older have lightning. This is what a USB-C cable looks like. So if you use this for your charger, you've got a USB-C port and this is what a lightning cable looks like. So if you use this for your charger, then you've got a lightning port. Now that you know that, you can then go and get the adapter. My iPhone's got a USB-C port, so therefore I've got a USB-C adapter. I'll go and link down below to USB-C and lightning adapters. So I've got a USB-C to USB-A. So therefore you can go and plug the USB in this end and I can then plug it into my phone. But you can also get lightning to USB as well. And then what you want to do is go and plug it into your iPhone, just like so. Now that it's connected, you can actually go and see it in your files app. So go and open your files up like so. And what you'll need to do is click on browse or possibly back like so. And then as you can see in locations, we can go and see the drive here. Now my USB is called USB. Yours may be called something different, but it should have a little drive icon next to it. Then you can go and click on it and see your files if there are any on it. And to move files to or from your USB and iPhone, just find the file, whether it be on your iPhone or the USB. And all you need to do is hold your finger on it like so and then go and press on move. And then you just wanna go and press on the back in the top left to get to the browse page. And you can then choose where you want to move it to. So whether it be from your iPhone to the USB or vice versa, in this case, it's from my USB to my iPhone. So let me click on my iPhone, then press copy, and then it will go and transfer it. It will take longer if you've got more files and larger sizes as well. And then to move photos from your photos app to the USB, super easy. Open up the photos app and click on select in the top right and then select the photos and videos you want to transfer. I'll just do these two here. Then click on the share button in the bottom left. And then you can scroll down and click on save to files just here. Your files will open up and you'll need to click on the back button in the top left. And then you can go and select your USB by that little drive icon there. Click on it and then you can go and click on save. You can go and create folders by clicking on the three dots in the top right there as well and clicking on new folder. Then they'll go and copy. So just wait and they've now finished and that's it. You can then go and disconnect the USB from your iPhone and maybe put it onto another device. If you found this guide useful, then please leave a like.